Okay, so uh, the little scene I was working on, uh, mostly, I grabbed a bunch of uh, assets and uh, went through some tutorials and learned about the grid map. So I threw a bunch of tiles from Kenny, of course, into uh, a scene and then told it to convert it to a mesh lib. And then I made this scene and I added a grid map and then pointed it at that tiles and it gave me all of these. And let's, uh, let's add some snowy blocks now. So let me go back down to the tiles at the bottom. There we go. I can paint myself a nice little, little world. And uh, I guess I could use the floor, or I could just go down a level. And yeah, go up another level, and paint to my heart's content. And then I made myself a second grid map layer for uh, fencing, mostly so that the fencing wouldn't get in the way of things, actually. And I can rotate that. Oh, I do that in the air. Oh, that's my bad. Let me, uh... Let me uh... Where is that? Ah, there it is. There we go. I wanted to draw that here. Flip it around. Draw a little bit there. And then we can add a broken fence and some corners. And voila! So that's pretty cool. The grid map is awesome. And then I just added some alpacas because they are silly. And actually, let me... Let those just jump around their heart's content. There we go. So yeah. Grid map is awesome. You can create little bridges and things. Um, again, I did that on the fence layer. And uh, yeah, so once you build some blocks, you can create worlds really fast. Um, you know, like your traditional RPG maker or something like that. Um, except, of course, with the real proper power of a proper game engine. So yeah, wicked excited.